one thing we're trying to do is to get the whole team to, to look past all the little accolades that we're getting before the season, before we have a chance to prove anything. So when the season's over with and that still stands, then, then that's a goal well accomplished. I've been focusing morally on getting the secondary ready because uh, that's, that's one area where we tend to have little problems. We had little problems with them last year, but since we have such you know many new guys, it's, it's, it's been a challenge to get them to understand that how to play your position, what you're supposed to do, and, and, and where to be to put yourself in the right place at the right time. So that's, that's one thing that I've, I've been trying to do is take the time out to, to tell them what I know and, then, and give them keys for success. Oh man, I love bowling. I've been I've been bowling since I was little. Me, my brother, and my my sister, we used to go to bowling alley when it was real little, because my father and my mother bowled a lot. And one year, I guess we was old enough, so my father bought all of us a bowling ball, and we entered in the tournament summer league. And that's how my skills started getting better. I used to play my dad, and he used to whoop me all the time, and and it, it used to it used to hurt, but. At the same time, I, I saw what he did and it, it helped me out to now where I can bowl. I can't beat him still, but I can get close. My fondest memory, I'd have to say uh, me being accepted back into EKU because I was going through a, you know, an era well where uh, I was selfish and, and I left EKU to go to another school. and. For Coach Hood to, you know, to accept me and for me to prove my loyalty to the team and to him, you know, that, that's that's probably the best memory I've ever had because I felt welcome when they let me back in. Mm -hmm.